Whoosh. This is Whoosh. Hey, I'm Tyler and welcome to my YouTube channel where we talk about tech and do vlogs. If you clicked on this video, you may already know what Whoosh is, but if not, let me explain. According to 9to5Mac, Woosh is the only Apple certified screen cleaner and is used in Apple stores all around the world. Woosh doesn't only shine your screen, but it also disinfects it. In today's video, we're going to be talking about whether or not Woosh is still worth it and a good product to buy for your tech in 2023. I want to start off by saying that Woosh did not sponsor this video at all in any way. The bottle that I am using in this video, I paid for it by myself. Now, I bought a 3.4 ounce bottle off of Amazon and I'll leave a link to Woosh's Amazon store down below. And remember, while you're looking at that, if you like this video and you want to see more content like this, leave a like and hit that subscribe button. The bottle that I got came with two microfiber cloths and some safety information about the product. And also, on a side note, these microfiber cloths are amazing even without the spray on them. They have grooves on them, which makes them perfect for getting rid of water drops and smudges. However, when I'm not using the spray, or if I just don't have the spray with me, I usually use the Apple microfiber cloth, which I will also leave a link to in the description. I don't want to talk about that too much in this video since it's not the main focus, but let me know in the comments if you want to see a separate video about it. Now, I could keep telling you how amazing Woosh is, or I could show you how well it works, which is what I'm going to do now. The instructions say to first spray the solution onto one of the cloths two to three times. And the step that I usually forget but is actually really important is that you should always clean the screen with a dry microfiber cloth before using the solution. And like I said before, when I am not using the solution, I like to use the Apple microfiber cloth. Now, if you're only trying to remove smudges and dust from your screen, using a dry microfiber cloth should get the job done. But if you want a deeper clean to remove water drops and bacteria, that's where Woosh comes in handy. In this video, I'm using it to clean my M1 MacBook Air, but it can also be used on phones and tablets. Also, just a quick side note, it is good to make sure the screen that you're cleaning is semi-cold. This is because there's less of a chance that the Woosh will stick to the screen. So after you use a dry microfiber cloth, you're going to want to use a cloth that has the solution on it and rub it in circles on the screen of the device that you are trying to clean. Remember to get the part of the screen near the keyboard if you are cleaning a laptop because this is often where dust ends up. After you're done using the solution on the screen, use a dry microfiber cloth to get rid of any remaining liquid that may still be on the screen. If you bought the same bottle that I did, it should come with two microfiber cloths, so it's good to reserve one for using with solution and one for drying the screen afterwards. And that's it, your screen should look shiny as the day that you got it. Hope you enjoyed this video, and leave a like and subscribe if you want more content like this, and let me know what you thought about the video in the comments down below. If you want to listen to my videos offline or on the go, go check out my podcast linked in the description down below. See you in the next one. Oh,